Good morning. All right, we are on day two of training our cows to the milking stanchion. So we'll see how it goes today. Hopefully a little bit better than yesterday. Okay, so Nathan, you're going to be the guy that lures her in with the food. And then right? I hand it off to Josh. And then you're going to hand it over to Josh, who's going to be on the other side of the head gate, right? Mm -hmm. And Caleb, you're going to help. I'm going to help push uh, him into the right spot. Yeah, help get her up on the platform. And I'm going to video. So here we go, guys. Let's give it a try. Let's try and oh, good girl. There you go. Good girl. Good. Good girl, Rosa. Good girl. She did it yesterday. So they go through. Oh, almost there. Okay, take take three. Maybe she'll do it this time. Come on, girl. Come on, Rosie, get that food. You know you want it. Come on, girl. No, not this way. Yeah, hi, girl. Hi. Hi. Go get the food. You can do it, girl. You can do it. Go on. We got a storm coming, girl. Now or never. Nope. Well, at least she's on the platform. That's good. She's scooting it backwards. She's scooting it off. <laughs> well, we know she can get her head through the gate because she did it yesterday. And today she at least got on the platform a little bit. What do you think, Clover? Do you think you can do better than Rosa? <laughs> She did it! Good job, Clover! Good job, Clover! Okay, so Rosa's uh, quite stubborn. <laughs> She's going to be a little bit harder. Uh, we actually thought Clover was going to be the hardest one to get up there, but I'm encouraged. She did really good today. So uh, we'll try again tomorrow and see how it goes. Nathan, are you ready for this? Yeah. Joshua, are you ready for this? Yep. Caleb, are you ready for this? Sure I am. Cool. Let's do it. Good morning. Uh, we are ready to do our third attempt at getting our cows up on the milking stanchion. So come and join us. We'll see how it goes today. I'm coming. Here we go. Go on, girl. Food's that way. Food's that way. 
<laughs> get it girl, you can do it. <laughs> She's almost there, there we go. Oh, one horn's still out. <laughs> She's going for it. Oh, I can't. Hey, climb on this and lift that up so you can get her other horn out. Good job, guys. Up it, up it, up it. There you go. Good. Okay. Did she get it in? Good teamwork, guys. Oh my goodness, she's too strong, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> she gets one horn in. And come on, girl. You can do it. There you go. Almost there. Woohoo! We did it. You did it. Good job, Rosa. Good job, boys. Teamwork. She's uh, still hanging off the back end here, though. She's just barely in. But there's plenty of room she can move back up. Woo! Good job, guys. Good work, Nathan. See, that's not so bad, Rosa. We don't want to close it up yet because I'm afraid to do it without Daddy here. Because I've heard they can go crazy if they get locked in for the first time. So we're going to wait for Daddy for that. But she's in. She's just not locked in yet. Okay, everybody, go give her some pets. Come on, Clover. There you go. You can do it. You can do it, girl. Those horns are hard to get in there, but once they figure it out, it's no problem. She thinks she has to turn it, but she doesn't. There we go. There she goes. Good. Okay, so how are her feet? She's got her feet hanging off too. She's not so sure about that yet. There we go. You can do it, Clover. She's in, that's a good sign. But she's still not sure about staying in, huh? <laughs> what do you mean by two horns? Come on, Clover. Get that other horn in. There we go, there we go. There you go. Good job, Clover. She can't see behind her really, so she can just turn her head wherever she wants. <laughs> you want to try and touch her udder a little bit, Caleb? Sure, just a second. Her just, food fell. So oh, Josh is getting it. the food. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. It's what I've done! You just brought and I just got help. <laughs> so we're going to have to reposition the food out a little bit so they get their back feet in. Feet up on the platform. I got milk out! There you go. Good. She doesn't seem to mind that. Uh, maybe a little bit. <laughs> hey, good girl. Is that a good treat? There's still ton left, Nate. She was just out of it. You get milk out? Yeah, look. That went so well. I'm really glad they both ended up finding out how to get their horns in there. <laughs> Took a while, but once they figured it out, it was super easy get their horns through the head gate. So that's really cool. Very excited. And Nathan, what did you get to do? I even milked Rose and I got milk out of her udders. Good job. That's awesome. She wasn't even in the stanchion. She was just yep. off to the side eating. Yep. And you went right up and got some milk out. Yep. That's very encouraging. So I know some of you might be thinking, those are not wild cows. Um, because they did so well. Well, we've been working on them for about three weeks now. And when they first got here, they would run away from us. If we got in between Rosa and her calf, she'd come after us. So they were pretty wild, but they have done awesome. And we're just really hopeful that we're gonna have milk one day soon. So we'll let you be a part of that adventure when it happens. Little kitty, basking in the sun. Oh, he was, now he's up and moving. You like the trampoline? Is that a warm place to be in the morning?
watching Naomi while we did the cows. I appreciate that. You did such a good job babysitting. <laughs> Thank you.